Hi, I'm Deep Singh, founder of Kandeeps.com, and in this video, I'll walk you through on how to import page templates for our portal theme. Let's get started. What I have here is a default installation of DNN7, and I'm just going to go ahead and log in as a host. You could log in as an admin for this task as well. And once you're logged in, what we want to do is basically create new pages or replace existing pages with existing content installing. So let's head over to our documentation on our site and we're looking at portal documentation we want to see how to import a page template. So one of the first things we want to do is upload assets. Now assets are image files which basically you know it's content that gets plugged into your HTML. You don't have to upload assets if you're going to eventually up replace those images with your images anyways but if you want to see the default placeholders then you would have to follow this step. You can also skip this step if you've previously imported the portal template. If you ever imported the portal template on this site, then it automatically imports the assets for you as well. You can always refer to the portal template video to see how to import an entire portal. All right, so let's get started. From your downloads from DNN Store, you would have a file like this, which says uh, extract me. Make sure you unzip or extract this file, and in the folder, you're gonna find the templates folder. We're interested in the pages because we want to import an individual page instead of the entire portal. But the assets are actually located into the portal uh, folder. It's called portal.template.resources. Now, we have to temporarily go ahead and rename this to .zip because you cannot upload .resources for, uh, files. So let's go ahead and do that. So next from file admin management, we're going to go ahead and uh, upload and decompress these files. So let's go ahead and do that. Switch to our site, go to admin, file management, make sure you have your root folder selected, click on upload, make sure we select decompress zip files, and then we're going to look for the file. So in my case, that file we just renamed is right here. We're going to upload and decompress it. So this process uh, is now complete and it's telling us that four of the 184 files were not extracted these particular four mp4 OGV, mp4 OGV and the reason for that is is because I don't have these extensions as allowed extensions on my DNN host uh, installation so let's go ahead and take a look where would you specify that really quick for these you have to be logged in as host so make sure you logged in as host go to host host settings go to other settings and these are your allowable file extensions so for us we want to make sure that we add mp4 and OGV so you would want to do this first before attempting to actually upload the file I'm gonna go ahead and uh, try to upload one more time just make sure we don't have those issues and select the root folder hit upload make sure decompress is checked and we're gonna upload this file okay so everything is good now we're done with uploading our assets and now we can actually go ahead and start uploading the templates so let's look at the next step next step is to upload the templates so from file admin file manager we can upload the templates we want I'm just gonna go ahead and switch over to the portal demo site right here and uh, take a look at one of the pages. Let's look at the team page. Uh, okay, so I like this page and I want to import this page into my DNA installation but I don't want to import the entire portal. Great, so skip, switch back to the documentation and let's upload the template and then we'll follow through with the documentation. So in this file management, that's from admin file management, go ahead and click on templates, hit upload and now we want to go ahead and upload the template for the page we want to import. So in pages you see that we have a lot of different templates. I was interested in the team one, I see that right here, team.page.templates. I'm going to go ahead and import that in. Great, that's imported. So if you refer back to documentation, uploading templates is now done. Now we can go ahead and actually use the template. We can create a new page with a template or we can replace an existing page with a template. So let's go ahead and first really quick replace an existing page. To replace an existing page, navigate the, to the page you want to replace. In my case, I only have one, home. And from pages, you're going to say import. 
from folder uh, make sure that's template from the templates you're going to choose your team this is the template we just uh, uploaded we're going to say replace the current page and hit import okay so this doesn't exactly look like what we intended and the reason for that is because we don't have portal theme applied to this page so let's go ahead and do that now you could either apply the portal team to this page or to your entire portal in my case I had the default DNN theme applied and that's why it looks funky but let's go ahead and change this really quick to portal and there we go as you can see now we have a complete page that's ready to go and working exactly like the demo site the only difference is you don't have the images you only have placeholders which you will replace with your own images great so let's see how we can create a new page with a portal temp with a page template we can we can do that very easily too we just simply go pages add new page so I'm gonna go ahead and do that so add new page and I said this is my team page and uh, from the templates folder for the page template I'm gonna choose team remember we need to go ahead and make sure that portal theme is applied so I'm gonna go ahead and do that or you can always apply it at the portal level so you don't have to do it individually at each page so I'm gonna go ahead and do that from here and hit add page and there we go we just created a new page called team with our portal template so that's how you could go ahead and import individual pages if you do not want to import the entire portal. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or concerns, please open a support ticket and we'll be happy to assist you.